One of the questions that, you know, people are very concerned with because a live sport truly needs to be live. Can you talk about what the latency is um, with the services? Um, yeah, I mean, there's, again, across the video industry, there's lots of talk about low latency and ultra low latency. So low latency typically tends to be about anything between about five and 15 seconds of latency from the, from the camera, from the glass of the camera through to the glass, which is your screen of the viewer watching it. Um, ultra low latency typically tends to be around under a second. And majority of the, the kind of the live broadcasts we see right now typically come into the low latency rather than the ultra low latency um, category. Um, but you know, everything that we can do at, you know, as an industry to, to cut down that latency, to make sure that the glass to glass time is as low as possible, actually increases engagement from sports fans and from, you know, from live event fans. Um, but also a better, a better user experience if you don't hear your neighbors um, suddenly cheering and then five seconds or 10 seconds later, you see, you see the goal happening. But, you know, yeah, it's, that, again, that, 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 that's definitely not good. No, not good. But, but of course, you know, there, there are lots of solutions out there for, for, for implementing watermarking. And there are lots of solutions out there for, for doing content figure printing. Unfortunately, some tend to add additional latency to the stream. So if you're watching, watching a stream and you're, you know, you're watching an ultra latency stream, you want to make sure that you're, you're getting that content as quickly as possible. If you're having to go through a, a chain which adds many seconds of buffering and delay while it watermarks, that really isn't going to be a successful solution for, for the business. Well, absolutely. And that's, you know, that's very important. And it's, uh, it, it's exciting to know that, you know, the latency or the potential latency with a front MTS solution is very minimal. You oh, talked about the asset. Significantly less than, 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 than I think pretty much most in market, which is, which is right. Great. See. 